why don't you go ahead and tweet us your predictions. That is, of course, at LOL Esports. Hashtag ROC win or hashtag OG win. See who you think is going to take this game. Will be Rocket grabbing themselves another on the books, or will Origin match Fanatic's perfect start at 6 and 0? Only time will tell. And let's find out as we load up onto the rift. Spot him enough time to see at least where Steve was. Soas had the option to maybe rush the dragon if he wanted to. He decides to go top, push that wave back in, and Niels is dealing with the bot lane. So that's why Origin's not going for Dragon, because Rocket pushed into waves and they want to make a pick. They do, and they find Mythy. Let's see if they can take down the cow. They do. That's first blood right off the bat. Now amazing on the retreat path as Yankos dodges away. There's the fire burning him down, and Yankos will manage to pick up a kill on the Dragon for Rocket. Fantastic play by Rocket. Exactly what he needed. I said, look at the side waves. Top wave was pushing, bot wave was pushing. Rocket group popped on the hunt, made a play on that second Dragon, secured a Dragon and two kills, and they're now 1,000 gold ahead. So and it's, it's some of the pitfalls that Elements sometimes fell into. There's not enough make clear, but we might see another on the hunt forcing something here, though. We might, as the ward goes down. Amazing is going to be the one to kick Gick packed in. And Woolite will take him down, teleport in for Soaz, but the fight is already on. Yankos is burning down the blood. He'll be going down with the Hemo Plague. Double kill over to Vladimir as he's able to take down Vander. Soaz, however, is melting. Equalizer's down. Mithy is zoned out of this one. And Peke isolated from him. But in comes the calling around the side from Niels. Woolite heals, but it's not enough. Steve is going to burn a flash, but Niels is on him. Another summoner heal popped just for the speed up. And Steve is trying to get away. The oh. headbutt has no damage. Steve walks it out. Steve hit, getting the eject button from Miffy. If this was old Alistar, we would have seen headbutt slap. Let's see, yeah, three points in Pulverize, one in headbutt. Once he gets to the fourth rank of Pulverize, that's when the headbutt Pulverize combo is on the exact same cooldown, but Peke. Oh, he could be down. Yes, he is. Yankos will send a foot through his face. As Miffy and Amazing were too slow to respond, Rocket are playing aggressive. This is the most active we've seen Peke really be yep. uh, since rejoining the LCS here. We'll see if he's able to stop this wave from happening, but I don't know if he'll be able to do that one. In comes Soaz, the fish is on. Nuke Duck, who is going to get jumped on, but Soaz might have gone a little too far forward. Mithy, hey, man, come on. Rise, that's what they needed. Will Origin be able to get the pick off Niels? Going low, the equalizer equalizes Niels. Peke is pooling away, but Rocket have surrounded him. And that's another kill. Yankos picks up one. Origin tried to even out the gold lead, but instead they get equalized by Steve. And this is the first time at 20 minutes that Origin finds himself properly. And definitely so. And I almost feel like this is the longest Steve has gone without dying in a game. It's improving week after four. week. He, yeah, caught behind in CS a little bit early, but he's catching up. Actually. I lied, he's not catching up, but he's doing well. Well, when, you're, when you're versus Soaz, it's a little rough. Let's see what happens here as Mithy gets caught. In comes Yankos, goes for the insect. No one was really there to answer, except for now. Vanders come on in. Woolite will pick off Mithy. Steve from around the side, burning, burning as Niels goes down. A double kill over to Woolite to secure that one. It ends up being a two for one, with Yankos giving his life and ex Peke nearly following. And we often say Woolite should stop flashing in aggressively in fights, but when Rocket has a gold lead of this magnitude, then he can do it. It picks up another kill, and Origin playing these fights as if they're winning, but that's not enough. Not they enough can't take these fights like this, and Rocket keeps deciding the tempo, keeps deciding the pace, pick up another tower, another two kills. Mm -hmm. But he can't draw that much aggro that allows Origin to survive on the other side of the map, because, again, they just don't have the wave clip for us. They're forcing these all-in type of fights, and if they can't flank, it's easy for Rocket to peel back. Mm, so as trying to get out of a bad situation, but they've all jumped on him. Playful and Trickster, but in comes Yank Ghost. Woolite will secure the kill. Coling is on. Amazing. Gonna get fired down the equalizer. Mithy's health bar is evaporating. His unbreakable will comes in too late. That's a double kill for Woolite, who extends his score. And Rocket might be pinging for Baron. Another double kill for Woolite there. Good engage on Soaz, they realize that yes, he might be nimble, yes, he might be swift, but we can still catch him. Using the Nautilus ultimate and it'll trail him. Yes, he might hop over the wall, but he will still get knocked up. Yankos connects the Q. Amazing is dead, no smite. With Dragon number four, they're looking to start entering the end game here. Nuke Duck, Steve, and Woolite are all roving together with Yankos, of course, around the side. Also with Vander. Let's see if Origin can stem the tide. In comes the calling. Niels doesn't spend it on the wave, however. Aki is down right there. Let's see what Rocket can make of it. We've seen Rocket play decently well from behind and try and hang on. It's one of the first times we've seen them in the lead. Let's see how well they can close. 
Looking to dredge line dodged away by Playful Trickster from Soaz Inhibitor, however, is not going to be so lucky. Down it goes, 30 minutes on the clock. Rockcat have cracked the origin base. And this is looking to be an upset if it keeps going this way. The fight's on, Equalizer down by Peke, and Mithy zoning Nuke Duck about in the back, and in comes Nuke Duck, slides and glides, and everyone from Origin is evaporating. There's a double kill to Nuke Duck. They paid with Yankos yet again, but they can keep on shoving in the base. And this Sever pick is paying dividends. Rocket first picked it, where we see in his fights, Expect as oh. with his Vladimir, as we see Nuke Duck take down the cow for an extra that's sick there, but I also just want to point out this Vladimir wants to dive on the ED carry, but spell shield blocks one spell, and then on the hunt makes you even quicker than it goes Vladimir. And Rockat, they're taking this game. They Second are. win in the LCS. The Ace, Ace comes out. That is it. 31 minutes in, Rockat become the first team to take down Origin. <laughs> what a win it was. Smiles on their faces there, and they...